I'm Danielle from Pearl World, and today I'm going to show you how to print a latte mug using your mug press. The mug press that I'm going to use today is our 3-in-1 mug press. It has heating elements for a standard mug, 11 ounce to 15 ounce mugs, a small latte, 12 ounce, or a larger latte or tumbler. All these come included with the heat press. I've already uh, put on my small latte because that's the one that we're going to be pressing today. The other items that you'll need are your sublimation printer, your sublimation transfer paper, your heat transfer tape, pair of scissors to cut it out, your glove, nonstick sheet, a bowl of warm water, and your mug press and your latte mug. Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to take my printed transfer sheet. Now you can't really notice, but it is a mirrored image, and I've used my template that's located on our website. So under each sublimation product, product you're going to click on the download button for the template, and that's, it'll just make it easy for yourself. It includes a printable area as well as a bleed. Okay. So just cut it out, and you're just going to cut just around it. doesn't have to be tight to it. Okay, we're ready for our latte mug. You're just going to take your latte mug and place it directly in the center. Line it up and place a piece of tape on either side. And you are ready for your heat press. You're going to take your nonstick sheet and wrap it around your mug. And now the most important thing is the placement within your mug press. You want to make sure that the latte mug is directly in the center of your heating element. So when you place it in here, make sure that you have the same distance on the left side and on the right side. Push it down so it touches the bottom of your heating element. And then you are going to lock it closed. I have my pressure set at medium to heavy. My time is set at 240 seconds or 4 minutes. My Temperature is at 400 degrees, and when I mention that you want to have it touch the bottom of your heating element, if it doesn't touch the bottom, the distance between your mug and the heating element will cause it to not print properly. So always make sure you push it in so that way it hugs it tight when it, you lock it closed. Your mug press is all done. Slip on a pair of gloves. Open it up. Slide it out. And you're just going to take off your tape and your paper. And perfect. You're just going to dip it in your warm water. This will help stop the sublimation process and cool down your mug a little bit faster. And there you go. Perfectly printed latte mug. All it needs, some coffee. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you check out all of our other videos and products on the Pro World website. Good luck and happy printing.